Landing at Southampton, with not one sweater in her luggage, is film star Lana Turner and husband number four, Bob Topping. Colleague Eleanor Parker welcomes the honeymooning couple. Leaving behind in Hollywood the clothes that made her famous, the sweater queen, her hair dressed in an elaborate upswept style, causes a quayside traffic holder. Dockers down tools as Mr. and Mrs. Topping are helped off the gangway by Pathé's reporter. Playing down the cost of her over-publicized wedding, Lana answers a personal question. Lana, we, we've heard the most fantastic rumors that your trousseau cost £12,500. It's not true, is it? Well, strangely enough, we have heard the same rumor, and it is not true. I should like to be the first to say that. And you are so right. <laughs> It's not your first trip over here, Bob, is it? No, it isn't. I made for quite a few trips over here. Well, we're glad to see you, and we hope that you'll thoroughly enjoy yourselves over here. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, you very much. much. Bye. Bye. From a film star's trousseau to a baby's layette is no far cry. San Francisco holds its first baby show of the city's 25,000 Chinese population. The prize committee has decreed that the biggest awards will go to the tots in the best Chinese costumes. But all the kids are so cute, there are additional prizes for the heaviest baby, the deepest dimples, the longest eyelashes, the most curls, and the best teeth. By the time it ends, every one has an award. And the grand prize for the most beautiful gown goes to tiny Catherine Tong.